Hello friends, I am Rahul Kumar and this is tutorial part 3rd on Katia V5. In this I will teach you how to use different types of tools on part designing. So let's start this. To open a part designing workbench, we have to click on start, we have to select machine designing and under this we have to select part design. As I, as I already teach you in the last tuto tutorial about all these things about planes axis so now we will start in a fresh way uh, so to start the work on the uh, design we have to select uh, sketch and after that uh, we have to select any of this plane so I will select widget plane Here you can see so many tools are there. I will start each of them one by one. So we will start the work with a file tool. Through this tool, we can uh, create any types of any type of a file in more easy way. We will start from uh, a file option. If we select uh, this option, we can create any structure, rectangle, circle, square, rhombus, a li single line, anything. To uh, to make a circle, uh, we have to click on a point and we have to drag it. If we drag, it will form a, a circle, as you can see here. And to a exit from this uh, option we have to click again on the same option and it will come out so this is all about a file now i will teach you how to use rectangle option and and these all other options we will start from the simple rectangle if i select this one we can uh, create a simple simple rectangle here and in the top uh, you can see sorry in the top you can see this uh, horizontal and vertical length uh, they are seen if you don't want to to do in this way you can simply click the uh, values here and you can form the rectangle in the same way in the second word second one oriented rectangle if i click here you have to select a three point and it will form the rectangle and the third one it is all the same but it will form the parallelogram it means the opposite two side it will be parallel to each other so in this also you have to select a three point and it will form a parallelogram in the third point it is known as elongated hole in this in this case you have to uh, select a, a two point and it will form the structure and in the third point it, it is also same like this in this also you have to select a two point and it will form this types of structure here in the same way you can create a keyhole hexagon and uh, a centered rectangle so this all is about rectangle related uh, options now we will start with the circle in the first one the simple circle if i select it will here you can see here they are asking about the horizontal value vertical value and the radius but if you don't want all these things you can simply select any point and you can drag it and it will form the circle in the same way if you select the second one it this is known as a three point this is known as a three point circle 
in this case you have to select a th three point and it will form the circle and the third one this is known as a circle using coordinates in this uh, you have to put the value here and then it will form the uh, circle if i set the value like 100 horizontal 80 vertical and radius 10 then you can see here it will form here one circle in the same way in the third option you need uh, three lines to form th this type of structure for that i will create a three line here and after that i will select this option and i will select all the three line and it will form the circle here so th this is all about the circle and their options a different option and the fourth one is known as spine a spine and a file is a little bit same but here in this case you do not able to draw any type of a structure here in this case we can only draw curved structure as you can see if I, if I if I drag it also it, it forms form any other structure so in the same way if you want to exit from here you have to click on the spine again so this is all about a spine in the line ellipse is almost same like as a circle option in line you can see different options are there if I select the simple line we can create a simple line here the second option is known as infinite line if you have to draw any uh, long infinite line structure then you can select the select the option and you can form it in the third option in this case you have to require to circle in this case i will form to circle here and to find the, the tangent here I will select this two circle and it will form the common tangent here. In the third line, it is used to I set the line. As you can see, this two line. If I extend it, it will meet here. So to I set this two line in a proper way. I will select uh, the option and I will select the line and it will I select it as you can see here in the last option in this you need a curve or an arc or an uh, or any circle because in this case it is used to form a perpendicular line on the structure I already selected the option and now we will select the circle here and it will form as you drag it it will form a perpendicular line to the circle as you can see here it indicating the 90 degree here so this all about a file to delete all these things in a, in a single way you have to select all and you have to press the edit button and in, uh, in the next tool we will discuss about the operation to discuss about the operation I have to create one profile I will create a rectangle here And the first option is known as a corner. If I select, if I select uh, this option, here you can see so many option is is came. This in this each and every option is have different meaning. 
if I select the first option, uh, then I have to select a two line and it will form the structure here. But after that, it will trim the extra part here. If I select again in the second option, if I select this one and if I select uh, this two line, it will form the curve. But after that, it will trim the first line which is selected and it will keep the second line. In the same way, the third option is also similar in this. If I select this two line, it will form the st structure, but it won't trim this two line. It will keep this two extra part here. In the same way, this ch chamfer option is also work. It has the same meaning as like as corner. So this is all about chamfer. To explain about this uh, trim option and this all other option, I have to create line here. In this, the first option is known as trim. If I select the trim option, then its meaning is that the stuff part which you don't want to keep on the on the designing you have to remove it from the design you have to select the part and it will ask you to extend the line and the or the part uh, till the point you want to keep and apart from that it will remove so i will keep uh, this line up to here till at uh, this point and i will select the point and you can see the upper part of this line is removed only the second part is there so in this way the second part is known as break if i select this one its meaning is that if you want to separate this two line this line into different part i can say from here to here is one part and from this point to here is second part so i will select uh, this line and and the point from from which i want to separate it i will select uh, this point and now you can see this line is become two separate line this is the first and this is the second and, and that third one is known as erase or again or here the name is given quit trim it means that it means that if i select uh, this option it will easily it will easily remove any of this part if i select here and if I select uh, this line, it will easily uh, remove this point from here to here. So uh, this is all about. So this is all about uh, trim option. To explain about uh, sy symmetry in mirror, I have to uh, create some uh, file here. So in this the first option is known as, as mirror. So here you can see uh, actually its meaning is that if you want to create the same type of image in the other side of the design then you don't have to do the all the steps once again. You just select the mirror option and you have to select the part or, or the design which you want to form on the other side. So. I will uh, select the mirror option and I will uh, select uh, this line and, and I want uh, this line to be exactly in this in, in this part. So I will select the axis and you can see it form here. So in the same way if I want to create this line in the same way in this side I will select the mirror option and I will select the line and I will select the axis here it will form here. So in the second option is known as a symmetry. A symmetry is used do not want to uh, keep the extra part any, on any other side but uh, I mistake it form on the other side. So if you want this line to, to be replaced from here to this area you can select the symmetry option and you can select the line 
and you have to select the axis it will come in this area in this part so and it will remove from this uh, this line from this area so this is all about operation so friend uh, this is all about uh, part third on uh, ktr v5 in this uh, you learn about uh, different tools how to use on our uh, designing tomorrow i will upload the part 2 of this art uh, design i hope you like this thank you